Employees shall wear hard hats that are in good condition and meet applicable regulatory standards. Alteration of hard hats is prohibited. Hard hats shall be worn in the proper manner, with the brim to the front. The only exception is for welders whose hard hats may be reversed to accommodate welding shields while performing welding operations. When not welding, however, welders must wear hard hats with the brim to the front. Hearing protection is required where high levels of noise are present, that is, above 80 decibels. Employees shall wear approved safety glasses with side shields in all work areas except offices. Additional eye and or face protection such as goggles, face shields and welding shields shall be required when engaged in operations such as welding, burning, grinding, chipping, handling chemicals such as corrosive liquids or molten materials, drilling overhead, use of power actuated tools and pouring concrete. Employees and visitors may wear photogray safety lenses where permitted anywhere on the job size, but permanently tinted lenses may be worn only in outside work areas. Prescription glasses must meet the approved applicable regulatory standards and must be equipped with side shields. Coverall glasses or overspecs or goggles shall be required for prescription glasses that do not meet the standard. Employees engaged in welding shall wear filter lenses or plates specified by the applicable regulatory standards. These lenses shall be protected by safety plates on both sides. Employees assisting welders should not look directly at the welding process and must use approved eye protection. Employees engaged in operations using lasers shall use laser safety goggles suitable for the density of the laser beam being used. Such goggles shall be marked showing the visible light transmission, the laser wavelength for which such goggles were intended, and their optical densities. Employees will be informed of the exact location of eyewash stations. Foot protection. Work shoes or boots shall be constructed of hard leather with a steel toe cap inserted to provide sufficient protection to the front end of the shoe. Shoes shall cover the heels. Shoes, like boots, that cover the ankles are recommended. Sneakers 